Hey guys, Jared here. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to go in depth on setting up your YouTube channel, where to go to get your settings all put together, and personalize your page so that when people come and visit you, they know what you're about right after this. Alright guys, so we got your gear. We talked about that in the last video. Um, I'll put a little thing here so you guys can uh, check out that video if you haven't already. But now that you've got your gear ready and you're kind of setting up your YouTube channel, I want to go a little bit more in depth on what you need to do next. So um, it's going to start off by asking you for an email account. Now rather you use uh, some email that you're going to do for your business. Um, for your Google account, whatever you want to do, you're going to set that up and then it's going to ask you for a profile picture and I recommend you making that to you, your profile picture. Um, don't do a logo. Logos are really, um, they're impersonal and you want this to try to be as personal as possible. It's going to ask you to choose a logo if you look. Uh, we'll check it out here in a little bit, but um, I have a picture of myself. It's actually a picture of me in New York City whenever me and my wife went there for vacation. Um, but make that profile picture you. Make it something that is personal to you. Um, and it's going to attract people. It's going to let them know who you are. Give them a little idea of something about you. Um, so once you do that, we're going to go to uh, a screenshot here. And I will show you what we do next. All right, guys. So here we are. We are at our main screen. And what you're going to see is this little icon right here. Can you see that? You know, click it. Then it's going to take you, you're going to click your channel, and it's going to take you to this point right here. So whenever you're at this, you see things like your subscribers, uh, which we already got a new subscriber uh, since posting the first video of this series. Um, and my views have jumped up almost, I mean it doesn't show anything right now because it isn't updated, but it's jumped up almost 13, 15 views just today, just since I uploaded this video an hour ago I got 15 views I like guess that's, that's huge to me that's a big accomplishment um, so anyway so the first thing you're gonna see is you're gonna have your profile picture here which you can change at any time and then you have your cover photo now what I recommend you doing is going to this website right here canva.com setting up an account and they can give they have templates to uh, make things that look just like this. So whenever you click this, it kind of shows you a little bit more. Um, never mind, it doesn't show me anything at all. Um, it shows you what this looks like for your um, subscribers or people visiting your page. So this, you know, this is my name. I'm giving you tips and tricks, and streaming content, and much more. Because um, I'm going to go into doing stuff for like gear and and uh, other things like that and I do stream and if you ever want to talk about something or have questions about something I do stream live on Tuesdays and Thursdays uh, used to be Sundays but Sundays is now my content day for this stuff but uh, the link will be in the description below um, it's a twitch link and once you click on that you can come join me while I'm live and we can talk about things while I'm playing games or just chatting whatever it may be um, but I do stream uh, two days a week right now as I try to focus on creating content for this YouTube channel. So you've got your cover pet your cover photo, you've got your profile picture. And what we're gonna do now is we are going to get some of these little tabs set up. The most important one is your about. Um, so how you do that is you're gonna go customize channel. Once you're in the content editor, uh, you can mess with stuff for your home page, your videos, playlists, channels. Um, discussion which I haven't even really got into these two yet um, but you can go into this this is where you want to go right here the about me alright and you want to put down a description of some sort um, I'm just giving you giving you the basics for beginners and beyond everything from gaming to tech to content creation to starting your uh, YouTube channel I want to help you find what you need to succeed with your passion um, I got my business email here which is the email that I set up for my account and then I have links here and the links 
whenever you go to edit them, you want to make sure that you're putting links that you use. And these links right here are really important because what it does is up here in this top right corner um, on your cover photo, it shows uh, hyperlinks basically so people can uh, join you on other things. If you're just focusing on YouTube, it's going to kind of stunt your growth on everything that you're doing. Uh, probably the biggest help for me right now with this first video that I just put, the last video I just posted, is that I shared it on uh, Twitter and I shared it on Facebook right away and then I'm going to share it on Instagram uh, as soon as I get done recording this. And um, I know that three or four people already shared it for me on Facebook and I know I've had a little bit of traffic from Twitter um, and that's what's had the spike in views which you may not look at 15 views as really good um, per se but what I'm seeing it as is um, a big accomplishment for my first video like I'm excited for this I'm, I'm seeing growth already I'm seeing movement on the channel and that's the goal um, and that's kinda where we wanna bring this whole thing to is we wanna make sure that whenever we're putting these videos in whenever we're doing um, updates to the channel that everything is prepped and ready to go so that we can bring as many people to our channel and then take them to other forms of our social media um, so that everything kind of just cycles back and forth and it's like we're filtering people um, just right back into our content and that's the goal that's the goal whenever you're trying to be a content creator is you want to have all of these all these avenues for people to stay connected with you um, through all these different social media accounts. We're going to go back to the home page and we're going to go into this thing called YouTube Studio Beta. What the beta is going to do is it is going to get us into kind of the back end of our YouTube channel. So you can see here I have uh, videos and it shows you, look I got two more views. Like I, that's just really, really good. I'm really enjoying this. Um, so it's going to take you to the back end and show you different things about your videos. But what I want you guys to kind of do, just in this right here is going to help um, with the time of uploading videos. If you go to your settings and you go to upload defaults, and what you can do here is you can add um, title defaults. Um, this is something like you can add at the end of your title. Um, I don't have anything in there just because I haven't messed with it. Um, I've only had one actual video that I've felt like was successful so um, I haven't messed with that yet but then here's the big thing um, because like we talked about a little bit ago you want to filter everyone back into all your social media so then they can filter right back into your YouTube channel so what I did in the description is I have this follow along and I have all of my social media accounts um, and that is going to post at the bottom of your video right underneath your description that you type in for the video so it's automatically there you don't have to type it in every single time and it just kind of streamlines and makes everything just a little bit easier so you can focus on the video part of it and not on adding all the little nitty-gritty things alright now the next thing I want to show you guys is how you get this little icon here at the bottom of the screen so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over here you're gonna go to settings you're going to go to channel, branding, and then what you're going to do from there is you're going to, it's going to say upload uh, image, and then you can decide when you want to do it. Now what I did was I went back to the Canva website um, right here, and I created a thumbnail, no, I created a custom image, and make sure you do it 150 by 150 pixels and then I compressed the file it has a lower quality compress and I just put subscribe on it and then throw it up there so now there's a hyperlink to be able to subscribe um, to the channel just from that part of the video alright so that's kind of the basics on getting your profile started um, there's different tips and tricks and I'm gonna show you guys on what I'm learning um, and what helps me do things with like video videoing um, doing the editing and kind of step by step on what I do there. This right here, I hope this kind of helped you guys get started and getting ready to go um, so that when the traffic and the people start coming into your profile and into your page, um, they get a better idea of who you are and what you are. Now, 
Now look, what you want to do, and what I recommend doing, and I'm still doing, is go through some of these settings. Go through some of these things. Um, there's so much, and we're going to unpack it a little bit more um, here in the next couple videos on what you're able to do, what you're able to do after you've edited your video and uploaded it to YouTube. Um, what you can add with like um, endings, uh, whenever someone has the subscriber button and then there's like video recommendations here and there and maybe I'll have one here. Um, but there's recommendations and stuff like that and how you can set that up for your page um, and all your videos. And yeah, I think that's good. I think that kind of breaks it down for you. I uh, hope you guys like this video if you do please hit the like button hit the subscribe button um, join the channel join the community uh, I want to help you guys out however I can so if you guys have any questions or anything um, if I don't know the answer right away I'm gonna look it up or I'm gonna find someone that does and I'll get you the answer to kinda help you guys in the process as well um, so with that being said guys thank you guys for hanging out I'll see you guys next time Jared, out.